hey guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Susie and thank you so much for joining me if you are a returning subscriber welcome back so this is the first video of the year and I've been gone for a while because a lot has been happening we are going to talk about that but today I just felt a bit of energy <laughs> it's um actually what time is it it's 1 30 in the afternoon and I just came back from doing my, uh, I do like a quarterly shopping. I don't know what to call it, but every two to three months, I go to this African shop. I'll show you what I got. Oh. Okay. Every two to three months, I go to this African shop and I buy like, uh, I don't know if you guys can see and I buy some really good stuff that I enjoy so I'm just going to do like a haul and show you what I got because I got lots of stuff um this is not really like African but um they have like some ginger so I got some ginger I got some okra I got some okra what do you guys call okra in your language um, we call this, I'll show you what it looks like. I speak two languages by the way. I'm um, Shona and in Shona we call this Derere. You guys can see it. We call this um, Derere and in Isindebele we call it Itelele. So comment down below, let me know what you call this. I really love I don't know. I can't say I love, love, love Derere, but I do enjoy it once in a while. When we were kids, we used to have this, like, for fun. So, it wasn't my favorite thing. But now, that I can choose what I want to eat, I really enjoy it. And I got myself some oxtail. I love oxtail guys so I got myself some oxtail and oh, why did I mix this I don't know why I mixed this but I got sorghum it's sorghum amavele I don't know but I think it's amavele you know like that porridge so I wanted to make like a like sour porridge amavele so I got some of that um milk it's not mealy milk because I don't know guys so I got some of that powder like the sorghum because I will be making sour porridge I also got tilapia fish I got two of these which I'm actually going to cook tonight I also oh, is this what he meant when it said it's cut up I should have gotten for a whole chicken so this is like a rod runner this is like a raw runner. <clears throat> he asked if I wanted it cut up. I usually just get a whole chicken and I cut it up myself. So I don't know. I don't really know how they cut up their chicken. I might not be happy. But um, that's it. And I also got some goat meat. I love goat curry. So I also got some goat meat. And I got myself... Uh -oh. some Chinese broccoli so this is pretty much like the closest you can get to Infino or Morio Umbita what we have back home this is the ones that we have back home they are like single leaves but this is like a bunch so it's Chinese broccoli it's really soft. I don't know if you guys can see because it's focusing on my face. I don't know, child, but this is like um, Chinese broccoli. So this is as close as you can get um, to the veggies that we have back home. So now I'm just going to clean up.
Playing trances Going all to different places Different planets Watch your aura pass me by Losing balance What if we run out of time And second chances Empty handed You like the fast life You like to drive and get down and dirty You act like the bad guy Oh my god, it's been a long time since I did this. It's been a while since I did this, but oh man, I've been super tired and I still am tired. But you know what? I just thought today, let me just grab the camera and say hi to everyone. So I think today's vlog is... Actually, I think it's going to be a few days in my life because I want to clean the house. It's a mess. It's been a mess for a while and I know myself picking up the camera and recording it really motivates me to clean up my space. So what I'm going to do guys is I'm going to take you with me for a few days cleaning the house. Today we are going to start by, I think I was saying I have a heap of clothes on a mattress in one of the guest rooms and that needs to be folded so we're just gonna do a whole lot of housekeeping together so without wasting much of your time let's just get straight into the video I would say we were good together Come to an end We're letting 
All right, so I just finished doing my bathroom. I feel like everything's nice and clean. And uh, this is the shower. Everything's looking nice and tidy and clean, sparkling. And uh, that's the other side. So if you haven't watched, so there's a video that I did on how to keep your bathroom smelling nice and fresh. So if you haven't watched that one, I will pop it somewhere on the cards there. But I'm just going to show you. So this is my diffuser and I've had this for two years, guys. It smells amazing. And I think it was just like a Christmas um, edition in 2021. Yeah, I got this in 2021. Christmas edition and they never brought it back again. And this is the little that I have. I had a matching candle, but that's finished. And here I just put a candle just to make it look pretty, but I don't use that candle. And these are coffee beans, so they do absorb any odors, any funky smells. They do absorb that, and they also absorb moisture. So I, I just keep them in this open candle jar with the candle just for the aesthetics, but I don't really use that candle. And I have my soap dispenser, and I also have uh, this does not belong here. I keep it down here and I also have this little tray here which is my hair stuff and my mist that I use on my face my toothbrush and a candle and I uh, have done the toilet on this corner it's a bit messy there but I think I need all those things because I have that just in case someone needs to clean up after they've used the bath toilet and I also have like a little bin there so uh, that's that I'm just going to add <sighs> where's that hot pick? okay I'm going to add this one it's the hot pick marine splash one I love this stuff. So after cleaning the toilet, I like to just put it like so. And leave it like this. So that's it guys.
hard to share. I am adaptable. I am adaptable. Let it go, let it go, let it go, let it go. Safe for me to be grounded in the present I honor God when I honor me. I honor God when I honor you. you want to be honor me broken future I just received HelloFresh meals and I am subscribed to four meals a week because I also want to be flexible to make what I want during the week. So I have just subscribed for four meals and this is my second box by the way and I've done this before. I loved it and lately I've just been so lazy. Not lazy but I just... I think I'm not as motivated to cook. So HelloFresh provides uh, these meal kits. I don't know if you guys can see proper. So these are the meal kits and I got four meals. Let's see what meals I got. Okay, so these are the recipe cards. Um, these are the recipe cards for what I got. I'll come closer and I'll show you guys what I got. So the first meal that I got, so this is in no particular order. The first meal that I got is this Mediterranean chicken, Mediterranean chicken and a roast veggie toast. It looks nice. And the second meal is this char, <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce this, but is this char siu pork and oyster sauce noodle soup? I am definitely going to love this because I love anything Asian food, especially Thai food. And this one is the Aussie beef risos and rainbow fries with some coleslaw to go with it. And then the last one is this. Spiced pork and basil pesto guys. I love pesto. So I already know this is going to be a winner Where the last people standing still dancing when the lights come on the music is fading. So that's the pork for tonight so I'm gonna put this in the fridge and everything else I am going to put in the freezer so that's the chicken breasts and that's pork mince what else do we have and we have beef mince and we have this green dressing from one of the um, bowls that I'll be making um, this is just ice ice and this is a coleslaw mix because I have coleslaw with one of the other meals And uh, this is a garlic sauce. And this is the basil pesto dressing for tonight's dinner. Ah, uh, yuck. This is some Greek yogurt. Ice pack. 
eyes. Oh. Now this is chicken stock. This is some ginger paste. I will probably replace this ginger paste because I love myself fresh ginger. And I have some in the fridge. This is another packet of the basil pesto. More olives. I don't like olives, guys. The only reason I got olives is because every week you have to switch up your meals. And I forgot to switch up. So they just gave me the automatically chosen meals. That's why I have olives. I don't like olives. And this is the sauce for the Chinese dish that we'll be having. And what else? More garlic sauce and a dill parsley mayonnaise. I think this is a dressing for one of the meals. So that's it. Like the day before You're like a stone on my pillow I don't make a sound when I shut the door
Just looking at you makes my whole world spin. Hey guys, I know, I know this morning when I unpacked that HelloFresh meal kit, I said I'll be cooking one of the meals. But like I said, we got four meals out of seven days. So the other three, we can be flexible. So tonight we're going out to this Thai restaurant and it's one of my favorites. I love it. It's so homey. It's so warm. It's so, just so cozy. So that's where we're going tonight. And I will see you guys when we get there. Everyone's waiting for me. I'm actually loving my makeup. I'm looking at the viewfinder. Because I love it. I would say we were good together I would say we had fun But our trails will never run for today is Tuesday it is the following morning I started this vlog yesterday and um, I think last night when I was talking to you we were heading out for dinner and we came back and I was just too tired to you know to close off last night so I am back this morning I just woke up <laughs> you know what I thought I was gonna be so productive wake up around 8 or 7 and um start on with the things that i want to do because i've got so many things that i want to do but anyways i'm here which is what's important i just finished having my breakfast 
and I have some items with me that I want to unbox. I've been keeping these things for a while because I wanted to unbox them with you guys on here. So if you follow me on Instagram, which is all things Suzy Q on Instagram, you would have seen some of the pictures. But I just want to do it with you guys. So I'm going to show you these items first. So this is a vest. This is a vest, which is, it looks white on camera. Hang on. Okay, so I just um, reduced the lighting because I want you guys to see. While well, still the color is not as accurate, but it's got a lot of texture. I might put on a video on the side using my phone. It's got a lot of texture. It's off-white, creamish. I don't know. It's just like a bit rustic, and I think this would looks this would look nice on my buffet table. I don't know where I'm gonna put it, but I think it um, matches with the whole vibe that I'm going with in this house. And I also got this black one, which is also textured. It's got um, a little bit of white. Not too much, but just a bit of texture, lots of texture actually, and it's got like a tapered shape going on down here, which I like very much. I am definitely going to put this on my buffet table. I have been putting it there, it looks really nice, and I've got some baby's breath flowers which are dry, which I've been putting in. I'll show you guys. <laughs> <laughs> these are the flowers i've had these flowers since last year they are dry now completely dry and i love them guys i love baby spread uh, mainly for that reason because you can still use it while it's dry so this is how it looks i really like how it looks and yeah uh, this is how i'm gonna do it i'm gonna put it um because my buffet table is black um sort of charcoal brown but it it leans more to black so i'm gonna put some books and then put this on top of the books okay so now i am going to show you uh, this one uh, this is just a bedside lamp that i got i want to replace the ones that i already have so this is the top part, it's covered in plastic. I'm gonna go ahead and remove this plastic because I definitely won't be retaining them because I love them. Okay, so uh, this is the top part. This one's got texture as well. I don't know, I think I'm gonna, I don't know. So this one's got texture as well. It looks really nice, which is probably not picking up on camera. And how cute is it? It's so beautiful, guys. I love it. Love, love, love it. So I'm gonna be switching up my bedside um, lamps, and I love this one. It matches the vibe that I'm going with. I think I got a lot of lamps with this unboxing. This is the next one up. And I think uh, this one I'm going to return. It's so beautiful. I wish I could find like a lampshade which is not this color because I feel like it's too white for what I'm going for. I really like the neutral theme in my home, but this is too white. So I've already opened uh, this one. This is the base, which is so beautiful. It's so beautiful. I love it. I like that it's so big as well. But the lampshade is pure white. And I'm not going for pure white, guys. So I don't know. I'll see if I find like a cheaper lampshade. I'm probably going to change the lampshade and keep it. But I've got 60 days to make the decision. So I still have the receipt and everything. But I really love this lamp. Let me know, guys, what you think. Let me know what you think. I'll actually put it where I wanted to 
place it and then you guys can let me know uh, this is the last lamp i know i know we've had a lot of lamps let's see this is the floor lamp i want this for my lounge room so let's unbox Oh, oh, this is the lampshade it is huge it kind of comes off as white on camera but it is definitely not white i love it it's got like a gold detail here which is probably not showing on camera as well and there's this at the bottom so i pull it and I pull it and everything goes in like so then I just screw it up in. guys just um, forgive me the lighting is just bad the sun is coming and going but the last item that I have to unbox is this runner rug which is a black and white it's not really white but it's like an off whitish color i got two of these the other one i want to put in my kitchen just uh you know when you're doing the dishes i want a rug there all the time because um keep your feet warm it, it just looks nice i want to put it in between that space where there's this sink on this side and there's my stove i just want to put it there and the other one i am going to put just in front of my buffet side table so um let's do this <laughs> i don't know i hope i get everything that i want to do done today i get everything done because i haven't got much time and i also want this vlog to end tomorrow so hopefully can get if i can get quite a few things done today it will be long enough to post tomorrow so yes we are gonna do that i'm just going to clean up this area because it is full of boxes so i am just going to clean up let me know guys what you think of this one because i'm so i really like the bottom i like the color it's really good but this is putting me off so let me know what you think and i don't know i don't know i kind of know what i want to do but i just want to hear i just want to hear from other people because sometimes you know what decision you want to make but you just want to hear from other people so um blanket box which is my cushions and my bed linen but I'm thinking of switching things up I'm thinking of putting my towels in here because I have a basket in the bathroom that I put my I have a basket in the bathroom that I put my towels but because it's open and in this house there is a lot of dust so I have dust on my towels let me show you so this is the basket that I use for my towels in the bathroom but now I want to switch things up I'm going to put I think I'm going to put toilet paper in this one because I, I do buy a lot of quite a lot of toilet paper so i am going to put my toilet paper here and i am going to put my towels in here and i think i'm going to put my bed linen in the guest room
explaining how I choose to live my life because I told you when we started instead of just complaining you could try to treat me right but you gotta get out your head breathe in breathe out let me speak now what happened was a one-time thing no bullshit no lie I swear I'll try to give you my everything So this is what I've done. I have put all my towels in this blanket box. I'm just going to close it. So I am happy with that. And I'm just hoping um, they don't get dust <laughs> because they've been really dusty. And I have made my bed. I'm going to change my bedside tables, but not now. I'll probably put those in my son's room um, or in the guest room. But for now, I'm happy with the results. I have just quickly made the bed. I don't have time to, or rather, I'm lazy to steam the bed. But I'm kind of happy with um, what I have done. Now I'm just left with vacuuming the floors, though, because they are kind of dusty. Do -do -do. Yeah, so I'm just going to vacuum the floors. And... Yeah. I've sort of dimmed the light and I just want you guys to see how uh, this lamp looks like so this is the lampshade I hope you can see it yeah this is the true color a bit darker than it looks and this is the lamp I'm gonna change my TV unit but not now ah oh, not now guys it has taken me almost a year as you can see the tv is so much bigger because i changed my tv a few months ago and at the tv unit looks really small it looks really small and i am going to change it i just want you to see <coughs> the lamp that's the floor lamp and I'm going to put it on this side, as a, on that side or on that side. And I'm also going to install some curtains because it looks awkward in front of the door. But if I have curtains, I can always close them up and it looks like a complete wall. So uh, that's that. But I'll be taking you guys along with. So that's how it's looking. I really love it. To be honest, I love it. And this is that lamp. I've seen some designs where the lamp definitely matches with the couch, but it kind of looks awkward on that side. It definitely um, matches with the couch, but it looks awkward on that side. Let's take it there because I want you guys to see how it looks like. I want you to see how it looks like. So... This is the lamp. It's so white. Um, look at here. This ah, uh, okay. So this is uh, the runner. This is the runner that I just showed you. And I see. I want everything to be a, you know, a neutral. I want everything to be neutral, not too white. And I think that looks. Uh, it looks off never mind that black lamp it was in my son's room and i just gave him mine the ones that i was using because i'm gonna put the new ones in my bedroom so this is it
but i feel like if i change this i don't know i feel like if i change this it's going to look nice And uh, this is the black vase. So I wanted to put, so I put these books down there because I feel like they're just going to break um, the black going on because there's a lot of black going on from the um, side table. Then so the books kind of breaks that off and then I put my vase on the book. I don't know what I'm doing, but um, this is not how <laughs> the side table is going to look like. Uh, ah, you pushed the cards. Yeah, the one that's always pushing it. I'm not pushing it. <laughs> you literally just jumped on it mm -hmm. and pushed it. When I was two, me and my brother got separated from my mom. Mm -hmm. Is everything in focus? I think I'm washed out. I can put it on. It's okay. I think the sun's just playing up. But anyways, uh, that's okay. Good morning, guys. Um, today is Saturday, and I know I haven't filmed much because of work. But today we are going to be uh, doing quite a few things. I have laundry, so we're gonna do that together. And I want to while the laundry is running, I also want to get my plates out of the kitchen cupboard and put some of them in the buffet side table which is just behind me so we're gonna do that together because i want to create some space in my kitchen cupboards because at the moment things are a mess i have a lot of things in the pantry and actually not in the pantry so in my it's not a pantry i don't know what to call it so where the pantry is the light's gone again the lighting is just crazy because the sun keeps coming and going and i hate it okay okay so where the pantry is i have um a cupboard reserved for all my linen like my bed linen my punch my bed linen and laundry needs but because we haven't got much space i've used that space for some of my kitchen stuff so what i want to do is create some room in the kitchen so that some of the things can come into the kitchen because sometimes i just feel lazy to let's say to blend because i have to go behind and get the blender so i want to create room in the kitchen and see what we can do some of the things are actually in the garage, which is really not practical. So we're going to do that together. And if, we, if I get a chance, I am going to TK Maxx to get a golden mirror that I want to put above my buffet side table to complete the decor. I think things are coming together when it comes to house making i hope you guys enjoy uh, this video i think i'm going to close this video today Paco, can you please not okay. hi hi you're not even coming up anyway so <laughs> smile for the camera you're so big <laughs> what? smile let's smile <laughs> okay, you go. Where the last people standing, still dancing when the lights come on. The music is fading, but this is our favorite part. I used to feel like an outcast, but I think I'm alright after all. You make me feel like I belong You like me from me without all of the glitter And you make me laugh just like a little kid And all my insecurities just disappear when you're here with me I've been a stranger to this feeling Never felt so hard
the world You like me from me without all of the glitter And you make me laugh just like a little kid And all my insecurities just disappear But you're here with me I've been a stranger to this feeling Never felt so high I won't even care if you and I come crashing down
hey guys so i am back i just want to quickly show you what i got seeing i'm already holding this i will yeah i'll just show you what i got okay so first up i got this first i'm just going to reduce the lighting so you guys can see okay so uh, this is the vase that i got it's got really beautiful lines texture i really like it guys i think i got more than enough faces but i am just going to see where i can put them and i'm definitely going to return some of them because i don't need all of them so this is what this one looks like it's so beautiful it is so beautiful and it's tall i love this one i also got this ribbed vase oh my god it's so beautiful i got this from um from kmart look at this beautiful i have something similar i love this the color i don't know what color this is but it's not clear it's like it's got an orange tone to it which i think it's gonna match with the gold i love this i love 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 this one and it's quite heavy and sturdy so i really love it and the next one is this one i actually have something very very like exactly the same in terms of shape but this one is very 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 thick which i like and i think it's slightly smaller and this one is very clear the other one has like a gray tint to it let me bring it closer it's also ribbed i love it it's beautiful love 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 this i can't wait to style these things love it and moving on guys look at how thick focus focus look at how thick how thick this face is i love it guys look at this definitely going to put this on the console i love it beautiful and um i also got these high ranges these are just white I got these hide ranger st stems. I got two of them because they were quite expensive, nine dollars each. So I got two of them. Now these ones, and I was thinking I will cut them, cut them here, and put some hot glue, and stick them in. And you know the ones that they sell. They actually sell this kind of vase with um, with flowers in it. So for now, those two will do. And I think, yeah, I'll definitely cut the stems. But that's what I had in mind when I got these ones. I really like it. Um, what else did we get? What else did we get? <laughs> Guys, the hydrangeas are already falling. Okay, I also got myself i also got three of these um bulbs and i got them in warm white because i like my lighting to be warm when you're relaxing they create an ambiance i got three of them because i need two for my bedroom and i need one for my floor lamp in the lounge area love this i also got oh god i also got this um footed tray i don't know where i'm going to put this but i'm definitely going to find somewhere to put it love it love it love it love it but i'm definitely going to find somewhere don't know if you guys can see it. Somewhere to put it. Let's open it. Let's open it. Okay, I'm not sure about the color. 
I don't think the one that I saw in store looked like this. It's a bit warm, which is okay. I think it's okay. It will give. I think it's okay. Focus. It will go well with the gold that's in this house. And it's got fit. Oh, guys, I can use this on my kitchen bench. Oh, I don't know where I'm going to use it, really. But this one, I'm definitely not... Okay, I'm definitely not returning this one. I love it. I love the marble effect going on here. Love it. Um, wave deco bowl. Wave deco bowl. Um, it's actually really nice. And I like it. So I'll take it out. Which is not picking up on camera. But this is it. Oh, I like, I like, I like. <laughs> Guys, I don't know where I'm going to put some of these things. But I'm definitely going to keep receipts. And I'm definitely going to keep the boxes. Because I don't want to get stuck with something that I don't like. I have 60 days to make the decision. I also got... Um, this silicone mat thingy to put in my cupboard drawers, especially where there is pots and plates so that they don't scratch. It's, um, it's a roll, so I'm gonna cut according to the space. So, yeah. And what else did I get? Finally, I got these two books. I already have this book. But I just want another one to put um, in a different space. I love it. I love the black. I love the white. And uh, this is the other one. Oh, don't you just love this? Beautiful. Beautiful. This is the book. It says outdoor. I have lots of these books. I keep getting different ones. I like the tone. I like that they're neutral. So, yeah. That's all that I got. This huge mirror. So, it's got like a gold. Um, hang on. I'll take it out and show you. It doesn't look like gold. It doesn't look. So, it's got a gold frame. But the gold is not as yellow. I do want it too yellow, but this one is giving me copper vibes, so I don't know. Because this was on special and cheap, I might just have to spray paint it. Um, but I kind of like it. So this is the mirror. It is massive. It is big. I like it. Mm, love it, love it, love it, love it. So this is to put on my buffet side table. I'll put the inspiration somewhere here. I put a picture that I got from Pinterest. That you guys think, but this gold is kind of different from um, that gold. I think that would do. I'll see how I like it. So I'm going to mount the mirror to the wall. And I, I'm definitely taking that back. Um, I think I'll find something that will work for this space that one it's definitely not going to work and i am gonna remove this it doesn't belong here it's for my coffee table i'll see guys how i will play with this space uh i've got that one there and these are the things that i got so i'll see how i am going to play with these things i don't know i think i need more stems of the height ranges but yeah i think i'm kind of happy with where we headed oh okay guys i'm just going to show you Okay, I don't know if you guys can tell the difference. So this is the one that I already had. It's got like a gray tint to it. And this one is very clear. I like this one because it's quite thick. 
it's thicker than this one you can tell it's really good quality i got this one from target and this one i got from i got from tk max i got this one last year i just got this one today tell me now tell me something because i don't know how this gonna end oh no tell me now tell me something because i don't want to be just friends no no this is what we have so far i have stacked uh, these books i've put the black one and that other one on top and i've put the spheres and i've decided to put these in here for now i'll just keep switching things up till i'm happy with um with everything so on the other side i've put that footed thing here that marble thing and i've put a book on top and i've just placed this face like this for now i'm still not sure if i want to put the flowers in here or want to keep them there and just um have some i don't know i don't know what i'm doing but i definitely want to put something else in the middle something maybe with the candles or something i don't know i will keep playing with it but for now this is what we got for now this is what we got and i will keep you guys updated on what i would have done tell me now tell me something because i don't know how this gonna end oh no tell me now tell me something because i don't want to be just friends no no
Yeah, I know that I hope I'll be 